Welcome to Post Game Plus with Frank Isola. I'm Chris Sheeran. Kyrie Irving returns in the Nets defeat the Timberwolves 112-107. Got a little dicey yeah. towards the end there, Frank. But this is so powerful offensively as a team are the Nets that they were able to eat yeah, this. Yeah, another triple-double for James Harden. He was not happy with the way that he finished the game. He had four turnovers in that fourth quarter. Chris, the Nets had a 17-point lead in this game. They were outscored by seven over the last three quarters and Minnesota had a chance to take the lead in the final 20 seconds. So some things they still have to work on but guess what they do keep winning. Yeah and they're getting Kevin Durant back at some point too. Kyrie had missed the last three games while dealing with a personal issue but he jumped out of the gates quickly pouring in 15 first quarter points in route to 27. But the star of the night was James Harden who finished with 38 points in his 12th triple double of the season tying the net single season franchise record. Despite his monster night he still wasn't satisfied when he talked post game on the court with Michael and Sarah. Man I gotta be better. Especially down the stretch, you know, we turned the basketball over uh, a few times, which gave them opportunities to, to be able to score. So we got to do a, a better job, including myself, um, as the point guard of, of not turning the basketball over, getting a quality shot um, so we can have a good chance at guarding uh, defensively. What is the key to this team as far as managing expectations? Obviously, there's high hopes, expectations for this team. But what is the key in terms of managing the expectations and keeping the goal in mind? Consistency. Uh, every single night, you know, we, we, we got a target on our back, so we got to be prepared. Um, you know, Minnesota, for, for record-wise, isn't that great, but, you know, they gave us a fight. So we got to be prepared mentally and physically every single night to uh, to win games, no matter how they come, and tonight was one of those examples. I mean, anytime an opposing team comes in here or we're on the road, we feel like we're going to get their best shot, uh, you know, despite their record. So I uh, just feel like we couldn't get control of the pace of the game tonight. Uh, they were crashing offensive glass, doing the little things tonight, which um, kept them in the game. So a few mistakes on our end uh, that I feel like we can clean up. I think uh, we talked about in the locker room, uh, you know, as a group, just watch film tomorrow, see where we can get better. These games are coming quick, so, you know, we'll take the win and, um, you know, see where we can learn. The Nets continue their homestand on Wednesday when they host the Rockets. Pre-game coverage starts at 7 p.m. for Frank Isola. I'm Chris Sheeran. Thanks for joining us on Nets Post Game Plus.